if you have trouble configuring Kugik Smart Plug, please follow me through this video. I'll show you how to configure it successfully. First, if your device is offline or cannot be accessible, or you cannot add new devices, what you have to do is reboot Kugik Smart Plug by pressing the button for 10 seconds until the LED light turns red. When the LED light blinks green, it indicates that you have restored the device to factory settings. And then you need to delete your established but unaccessible device and kill the app for the time being. And then go to the Wi-Fi setting of your phone and add your device into your network again. When this is all done, reopen your Kugi HomeKit app and add a new device, identify accessory, read the code with your camera, and you'll be able to control your device over your smartphone again. At last, I want to thank you for watching this video. If you have any problems related to Kugik products, please let me know. I'm always there to help you out and enjoy today's modern lifestyle.